Hi everyone, Connie here again. Um, I'm just doing a little short video to help you get some ideas for um, the Deer and Fawn April Challenge. Um, in the challenge we must be using sprays, stencils, at least one paint colour and a household item to stamp with. So I thought I'd show you a couple of things to get you, you started. Um, it's all about using your imagination. So I decided I'll, um, I'll show you some um, things on the mixed media backgrounds I'd done last week. They're the two I done last week with the um, Pringles lid. So I'll show you that again. So it's just an ordinary everyday Pringles lid. And what I did, I've just taken some black paint, just paint around the edges like this, and stand. Easy, simple, awesome fun free, which is the best part of everything. Um, also, I've used before, um, this is a lid for my Pepsi bottle. I'm a Pepsi drinker. And this is a um, lid from a milk, a milk carton as well, which you can just do the same thing. It just gives you different size circles. Like so, and the Pepsi. I um, pretty much keep the lids off nearly everything that I have because they're just they're just awesome fun to use. Okay, we'll just put that on the side. Okay, some other ones that I've come across. Um, I've just picked these up today in my garage. Um, so I've never used with a piece of foam. I found this piece of foam in my garage, um, so I thought I'd give it a go, we'll just paint it on there, and we'll just stamp it and see what happens, oh that's pretty awesome, isn't that, the foam, the standard foam, I also um, found some, I think this is plasters tape, it's sticky on one side, I've used it before to spray through, but I've never used it to stamp with, so we'll give it a go. Maybe I'll cut a piece off. Cut a piece off. Bit of paint. And oh, look at that. That's cool. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. I like that. Okay, what else do I have here? I've got um, a bit of masking tape as well, which I've stamped off ink pads with before. I've used ink pads. I've, I've rubbed them in ink pads like this. I've never tried it with paint. I'll try it with paint. Now the paint I'm using is just some cheapy um, black paint, nothing special. Oh, look at that! That's pretty cool. See, give an awesome effect with the the tape. I've also used that with um, ink pads. I'll get any pack. And I'll show you just a okay. just like this. You can get another stamp effect that way as well. I've done that before. Okay, uh, what else do I have? I have here, I have some bubble wrap. Bubble wrap. Can't move. We'll just cut a piece off. Too big. Too big. Cut a piece off. I love circles, so put on there, like so. That's 
pretty cool. Look at that. That's pretty awesome. Okay. Oh, what else do I have here? I've got um, a freezer bag, which I've never tried before. So I'll try this out and scrunch it up. And a freezer bag. A bit scrunchy, a bit of texture. Just a bit in the paint. And just See, so that's pretty awesome too. Gives an awesome effect. See, it's just easy to find some basic things around the house that cost nothing. Rubbish, bits of rubbish. Um, I also found this a bit of string over a bit of um, the twine, which I'll give a go. I want to get a new one. I might just make a mess here. Maybe have to add a bit more water. Make it a bit more runny. Get it in there. Get it all. Make it up. In mixed media, you've got to be prepared to get a bit messy. I think it needs to be a bit. A bit more runnier, I think. Okay, oh, that's better. Okay. Okay. Oh, oh, oh. Look at that. Oh, that's pretty cool. I like that. That's awesome. I really like that. Okay, so I'll just clean my hand. Put it down. Oh, see, and that's another thing you could probably stamp with too. Is because it's got the texture on it. Okay, it's got that texture on there. Probably won't work. Oh yeah, look at that. You can paper towel. Is that nice little effect there? And last but not least, I wanted to try. I've I've heard of people using elastic bands to flick across the page. So I've um, put up a pizza box here, and I am gonna tent. Not very good. I was practicing before. Not very good at flicking elastic bands. But and give it a go. Get it all runny in. Okay. Oh, I flicked myself in the face. Oh. Well, that's pretty cool. I got my fingerprint on there, though. Oh, look at that. That's pretty cool. Oh, that's awesome. That's pretty awesome, isn't it? Um, well, I hope you enjoyed. I'm covered in black paint. I've got it all over my face from flicking the elastic band, so I must look pretty cool at the moment. Um, I can't wait to see what you all come up with. Um, just search your house. Find awesome things that you could probably stamp with, like I have, just cheap household items. I mean, you can pretty much use anything. Okay, can't wait to see your stuff. Thanks. Thanks for watching. Bye.